Hello everyone. Another day, another Bluetooth earphone and today what we have here is Mi Sports Bluetooth earphone. Now, this earphone has been out for a couple of months and has been a quite a popular choice. Mostly because of its price and its sound quality. But as you know, sound quality is not the only thing that makes and breaks the deal for a Bluetooth device. Convenience also plays a big factor. So does this earphone check all the boxes? Let's find out. Hey everyone, my name is Parth and you are watching InfoPal and today we will figure out whether Mi Sports Bluetooth earphone is worth your money or not. No, I'm not a writer. Okay. Now, every Bluetooth earphone has three main pillars. The build quality, the sound, and convenience. Now price plays a huge factor when you judge all these things. It is unfair to expect the same value from a 2000 rupees and a 10000 rupees earphone. But what we can expect whether it justifies its own price point. Mi Sports Bluetooth earphone costs rupees 14.99 or about 22 dollars. So let's set a bar of 15 points against its price. 4 points for its external features, 8 points for the internal features and 3 points for the extras. Now each of these categories has subcategories which is on your screen. Now any product if they get at least 90% score, I can easily recommend that product. Ready? So let's start with the build quality. This earphone comes with official IPX4 rating for sweat and water resistance which is great for this price point. Though I appreciate it a lot but on reality I am little doubtful with the overall build. The build is mostly comprised of good quality plastic and rubber but I do have concern on the wire part as it looks very thin and weak. That's why I would suggest you to arrange a carrying case or pouch. The overall build quality is about 1.5 out of 2. But using lighter materials like plastic and rubber has its own advantage. The earphone actually feels very light, the driver casing is very light and does not seem to come off. Although they do provide multiple sizes of earplugs, but there is only one ear hook which came out of the box. Quantities apart, the quality is good. It fits snugly to my ears, though I can't guarantee it would fit most of the people. What I can guarantee is the comfort. I have used this earphone for hours and it has not caused me any pain. For fit and comfort, it gets 2 out of 2. The sound quality of these earphones is surprisingly amazing. And it is the USP of this product. Just for sound quality alone, this product is a champion in its own segment. The overall sound signature is equivalent to OnePlus's Bullets Wireless. Warm and clear. Now if you want thumping bass, you can stay away from this pair. The bass is clear and punchy, but it won't shatter earth, if that is what you are expecting. It has a really good mid, so it's great for listening to vocals and podcast. Add to that a very clear high, it's great for listening music. Now there is a quite a unique thing to this earphone. It kind of gives an immersive feeling. So last week I was watching one TV series and there was a scene where a fly passes by. I can actually feel the fly passing by through my left side. This is surprisingly good and something I did not expect in this price point. Maybe because of its clarity, but I can actually sense a position of the object or the sound source. I can give 4 out of 4 for its sound quality. Now all this richness of sound is little bit tied down by its Bluetooth connectivity. To pair the earphone, keep it on your ear, press and hold the power button even after it says power on, until it says pairing. Then the device shows up on your screen, hit pair to connect. Although the connection itself is very fast, it's like you switch on the device and boom it is connected. But like every other Xiaomi Bluetooth device, it hates any obstruction. Be there is a wall or you have kept the phone in pocket, it shows disturbance. And that's kind of defeats the purpose of calling it a sports earphone. See, obviously when you are running or working out, you will keep the phone in pocket. And if the connection is not proper, it's kind of bummer. Yeah, it's not that bad, but it's not good either. So I would rate it 1 out of 2 for its connectivity. This device is kind of strange in its battery department. Let me explain why. First of all, this device is no endurance champ. 
it gives around 4 hours of usage in a single charge which takes about 1 hour but the problem lies in how it depicts the battery level it's pretty quick to drain to 30% from full charge you use the device for an hour and you will suddenly realize you have depleted 2/3 of your battery life but surprisingly for the last 30% it hangs on for long about 3 hours till it's absolutely dead so overall battery life is decent but i won't trust it if i am traveling for long time so i would rate it 1.5 out of 2 for battery life me sports bluetooth earphone has normal power and volume up and down button long press on volume button will change to previous and next tracks the power button also doubles up as play and pause button and that's about it so For the price I don't expect much though I would have definitely liked a magnetic feature to lock the earplugs overall it would get a 2.5 out of 3 for extra features so if we tally all these numbers this device gets 12.5 out of 15 which is about 83% now that's why it is difficult to recommend but if you consider other earphones in this price range I don't think many earphones will reach this score If your priority set to good sound quality and if you use exposed to a lot of sweat you can go for this device but you have to remember this device is plagued by not so good bluetooth connection and battery life that's about it hope i have helped you make a choice let me know what you think in the comment section this is part signing off from infopal and i'll see you in the next video